So picture this, we're in the year 2025 and your morning commute, it's powered by a $25,000 Tesla EV with 300 miles of range, as smooth and quiet as you ever imagined. At home, you've got an Optimus robot taking care of dinners and chores, freeing you up to actually enjoy your life. Even better, your night out with friends is made effortless by a sleek driverless robo taxi that's both affordable and futuristic. And after partying with your friends, you're gliding home with Tesla's unsupervised full self-driving tech doing all the work. From affordable EVs to cutting edge robots, Tesla's transforming everyday life in ways once thought impossible. 2025 isn't just another year, it's the future you've been waiting for. So how will Tesla's innovations transform your life next year? What are the specific five technologies announced by Elon for next year? But we, we expect to have several thousand Optimus robots produced and doing useful things by the end of next year uh, in the Tesla factories. Um, and then in 2026, ramping up production quite a bit. Um, and at that point, we'll be providing Optimus robots to uh, outside customers. That'll, that'll be production version two of Optimus. For the energy business, the most dramatic announcement is the Optimus, a humanoid robot designed to do tasks currently done by us humans. With production of the third version slated for next year, Optimus is expected to mark Tesla's first major foray into robotics. The robot's 5'8", weighs 125 pounds, and can do about 80% of what humans can, from chores around the house to heavy-duty industrial jobs. The price expected to run you about 20 grand, according to Tesla, which would make it affordable enough for an average household. Initial beta tests have already shown a 90% success rate for the Optimus in completing complex tasks like cooking and cleaning, with early risers reporting a 50% increase in productivity when integrated into their daily routines. The robot's AI allows it to learn and adapt, suggesting that it could even take on more complex jobs later on. If Optimus gets mass production and it proves to be reliable, it could reduce labor costs by 30% manufacturing and in other industries, while Tesla's existing plans with major retailers could lead to its use in customer-facing roles. Tesla projects sales of over a million units by the end of 2026, reflecting the scale of its vision for integrating robots into everyday life. Yet despite these projections, questions remain. Is Tesla overestimating its ability to ramp up production? Early reviews are promising, but scaling this kind of tech to millions of homes and workplaces is unprecedented. Still, the market potential is enormous. Global robotics is expected to reach 500 billion by the end of the decade. Tesla's success right here could showcase a defining moment in the future of labor and automation. Uh, but we are on track to, develop, to deliver a more affordable model in the first half of next year. Another long-promised development is Tesla's affordable electric vehicle, we'll call it an EV for short, expected to start production in the first half of next year. This one's priced at 25 grand, and the car is expected to be able to go 300 miles on just one charge, with the goal of attracting at least a million new customers a year, pushing Tesla's overall sales growth by 30%. The car is designed to democratize electric vehicle ownership, making it accessible to a broader audience beyond just Tesla's current premium market. Tesla's already secured $1 billion in investments to build new gigafactories dedicated to mass production, aiming to make half a million units annually by 2026. Early pre-launch reviews have given the car a 4.8 out of 5 rating, highlighting its quality and despite its low price point. While the affordable EV has the potential to disrupt the combustion engine car sector, the market's still full of doubts about this particular model. Understandable, too, because many conflicting rumors surrounding the undisclosed seedling. Is Tesla going to be able to actually cut down their production costs low enough to get to that $25,000 price tag? Moreover, the EV market is getting crowded out with competitors offering their own low-cost options like BYD's Dolphin, priced at over $20,000, Nissan Leaf's also a go-to choice, with a starting price of around twenty-seven dollars Chevrolet has also entered the electric car market. They got the Chevy Bolt EV, which costs $26,000. So Tesla's going to need to continue innovating to maintain its edge. But if Tesla can deliver on their promise, this would make EV ownership attainable for millions worldwide, hastening the transition to a more sustainable transportation future. I mean, based on the current trend, it seems as though we, we should get miles between interventions to be high enough uh, that it should be far enough in excess of humans that you could do unsupervised possibly by the end of this year. I would be shocked if we cannot do it next year. So 
next year seems highly probable. Perhaps the most eagerly anticipated development is Tesla's unsupervised FSD, which Elon confidently claims will be up and running next year. Tesla vehicles with this feature will be able to navigate cities without a driver. Musk has been promising this level of autonomy since 2019, but recent statements suggest technology is closer than ever. Right now, 100,000 Tesla drivers and more are participating in FSD beta, with the goal to have a billion miles driven by FSD cars by the end of 2026. Early data from this program shows a 95% success rate in navigating city areas. Tesla's working closely with regulatory bodies in states like Cali and New York to gain approval for its unsupervised FSD, which would mark a monumental step forward in autonomous vehicle technology. In the past, Elon has repeatedly missed deadlines, and regulatory approval is notoriously slow, especially when it's such a disruptive technology. But in just a few months, success will be evident, and unsupervised FSD is going to drastically cut down on traffic accidents, with some studies showing that autonomous vehicles could cut those rates by as much as half. Tesla's insurance partnerships also give discounted rates for FSD vehicles, incentivizing customers to further adopt the technology. This breakthrough could change not just how we drive, but also how we think about car ownership and transport. Moving toward this exciting future, the challenges we see today are laying the groundwork for a safer and efficient tomorrow. Um, I guess that that's really just a question of when do I expect the first, when can we do unsupervised full self-driving? The rollout of robo-taxi service is closely tied to the success of FSD. If the self-driving technology can achieve unsupervised status, Tesla wants to roll out a fleet of autonomous robo-taxis by October of next year. These vehicles will not require drivers and can go 24-7, cutting costs by 75% compared to regular current ride-hailing services. Early pilots in select cities have already demonstrated an average wait time of under five minutes for robo-taxis, and customer satisfaction rates are above 95%. Tesla hopes to generate $10 billion from robo-taxi service by 2027, with an initial fleet of half a million vehicles hitting the streets by 2026. Partnerships with major ride-sharing platforms have also been forged, ensuring a wide user base from the get-go. According to the daily info updated by Tesla till now, the company has received approval from the regulatory agency to circulate this model. Musk is very confident that ensuring the launch time of the Robotax near release date is indeed 2025. Closing out next year, Tesla is aiming to disrupt the freight transport industry with their Tesla Semi. This is an all-electric 18-wheeler expected to start production by the end of next year. With a range of 500 miles of charge and a payload capacity of 80,000 pounds, the Semi is designed to replace traditional diesel trucks. The Semi promises to save operators 200 grand in fuel costs across three years, and Tesla already has pre-orders from Walmart and Pepsi. The truck's projected to get 10% of the freight market in its first year and cut greenhouse gas emissions by 80% by the end of the decade. Analysts predict the semi could account for 15% of the freight industry by 2030, a big-time leap for electric trucks. So, how are they different from previous technologies? We're not just building cars, we're creating an ecosystem of sustainable and intelligent solutions that cater to various aspects of life, Musk emphasized. Affordability has become a hot topic in the car world. In the past, Tesla was all about the high-end models like the S and X, catering to that premium crowd. But fast forward to 2025, and we're seeing the arrival of more budget-friendly EVs aimed at making electric mobility accessible to a much bigger audience. Our new affordable EVs are designed to bring electric mobility to the masses, moving away from the exclusivity of our earlier models, Elon said. Everyone deserves a shot at driving the future. In addition to that, they said, our FSD 2025 version will set a new benchmark in autonomous driving, eliminating the need for humans. There's a major leap forward on the horizon. Previous versions of FSD needed a driver and only offered semi-autonomy. But come 2025, FSD promises full autonomy. No human needed. Kind of like we're stepping into that sci-fi movie where cars drive themselves. Total recall, anyone? All right, let's not forget about the exciting integration of robotics. Optimus is the first major step in the robotics field, leveraging AI expertise to create a robot that can integrate into everyday life. Elon explained, Tesla's earlier focus was primarily on automotive technology and energy, but now with the intro of Optimus, they're getting the head first into intelligent robotics. Picture this, a robot doing all your chores around the house. Daily chore automation and advanced industrial applications powered by AI are on the way. By embedding sophisticated AI, Optimus learns, adapts, and does a bunch of different tasks from household chores to complex industrial operations. 
This integration positions Tesla as a leader in the emerging field of robotics. What a time to be alive, right? And gone are the days when the emphasis was solely on individual vehicle ownership. RoboTaxi creates a new era in transportation where autonomous technology provides efficient and scalable mobility solutions, Elon remarked. By 2025, they're shifting gears towards shared mobility services. RoboTaxi's concept is leveraging autonomous technology to provide scalable transportation solutions, making it easier to get around town, kind of like having your personal chauffeur. Lastly, the focus on commercial solutions is getting more pronounced. Earlier products were centered on consumer vehicles and energy. With the intro of the semi in 2025, the company is targeting logistics and freight with sustainable and efficient transportation solutions. A game changer for commercial trucking, promoting eco-friendly practices and keeping businesses moving. It's like Tesla saying, let's save the planet while we're at it. How did Tesla prepare for this plan? In second quarter of this year, the financial results showed that the company not only gave us a detailed breakdown of recent financials, but also a glimpse into the future of its groundbreaking technologies. As usual, the focus wasn't just on money figures, but on the upcoming innovations that could potentially change industries, if not the world. An intricate strategy involving large-scale investment research and collaboration that's been years in the making. Central to Tesla's strategy is colossal investment in research and development. In 2024, Tesla earmarked $5 billion towards advancing AI, robotics, and FSD. This investment marks a shift, indicating that Tesla is prioritizing its technological lead more than ever before. That $5 billion budget is not just a pie-in-the-sky research project. It's targeted, it's deliberate, and aligns directly with Tesla's plans to roll out new features and products like Optimus, upgraded FSD, and more efficient batteries. Tesla's Optimus, for instance, is slated to benefit from this R&D focus. Elon often talked about the robot as a game changer, not just for Tesla, but society as a whole. Next year, Tesla plans to have the humanoid robot doing a wide array of tasks on its own, surpassing what the current robots are capable of. With this major investment, Tesla's building infrastructure and technology to make sure that Optimus isn't just another robot, but a true AI-driven assistant that integrates seamlessly into everyday life. To accommodate the expected demand for these products, Tesla's massively scaling up its production. One of the key strategies has been the expansion of Gigafactories. Tesla initiated plans to expand Gigafactory in Texas last year, investing $770 million to enhance production. The same year, plans were also underway to scale up production in Berlin, aiming to increase output to about a million vehicles a year. Also, Giga Shanghai, Giga Nevada are set for further expansion. These facilities are designed not just to increase production, but handle future production of Optimus and Tesla's highly anticipated battery technology, like those 4680 cells. The upcoming 4680 batteries developed in-house are at the core of Tesla's mission to cut costs and improve efficiency. These cells aren't just more powerful, but also more cost-effective to make, giving Tesla a significant competitive edge. In addition, Elon has invested in a Tesla semi-factory in Nevada with an investment of about $5 billion, expected to produce up to 100,000 Tesla semis every year. Expanding these factories is crucial as it allows Tesla to maintain control over the supply chain, ensuring they can meet demand while avoiding pitfalls of relying on external suppliers. Notably, Tesla's workforce has grown by 50% to match this production increase to meet the global demand of top-tier manufacturing. The company is aligned with top-tier companies like NVIDIA to enhance AI capabilities, particularly for FSD and robotics. Elon has been on a shopping spree, snapping up numerous startups in the AI sector to boost self-driving and enhance their products. One of the standout acquisitions was DeepScale, a startup specializing in machine learning and computer vision, which Tesla bought in 2019. This move aimed to supercharge Tesla's self-driving capabilities using advanced image recognition and data processing. Fast forward to 2022 and Tesla added another gem to its collection by acquiring Element AI, a Canadian-based startup. This purchase was all about ramping up research and development in AI. Most recently, Elon announced plans to invest a whopping $5 billion in yet another AI startup, underscoring Tesla's strong commitment to advancing AI technology for the company's long-term vision. These acquisitions allowed Tesla to stay ahead of the curve in AI development, giving it access to cutting-edge technologies that can be integrated into Optimus FSD and other future products. In addition, Tesla's teamed up with various academic institutions and research labs to focus on developing battery technology and advancing artificial intelligence. One key partner is the University of Texas in Austin, where cutting-edge research is being done to enhance battery performance in production for electric vehicles. 
Tesla's also joined forces with the University of Zagreb to streamline the battery manufacturing process. This collabo aims to boost production efficiency, cut costs, and improve the quality of battery cells. And that's not all. Tesla's established relationships with several other research organizations and top universities to push the envelope on advanced technologies in energy and AI. It's a smart strategy. After all, when you want to lead an innovation, partnering with the best minds in the world is the way to go. Another critical part of Tesla's preparation is the development of the Dojo supercomputer. Dojo is set to play a role in training Tesla's neural network, which are essential for FSD and Optimus. The sheer processing power of Dojo allows Tesla to process vast amounts of data, optimizing its AI systems faster and more efficiently than ever before. The supercomputer is not just about speed, it's about accuracy and improving the decision-making abilities of Tesla's AI systems. For FSD, it means safer, more reliable autonomous driving. For Optimus, this translates into the ability to perform tasks that previously required human intervention. This is a massive leap forward, making Tesla's AI-powered products more practical and capable in real-world applications. One of the most buzzworthy Tesla investments right now is FSD software. After four years of hard work, thousands of users are already testing beta versions. But this year's shaping up to be a game changer for FSD as Tesla hones in on making it widely accessible. Tesla's pouring in resources into ensuring FSD can navigate environments without humans. Thanks to the powerhouse Dojo, FSD is constantly learning from real-world situations to tackle complex driving scenarios all on its own. Elon's been quite the cheerleader for FSD, claiming it'll not only just transform the auto industry, but revolutionize transportation as we currently know it. Beyond personal driving, Tesla's FSD is set to be a cornerstone of the robo-taxi, allowing Tesla owners to get some extra cash by renting out their self-driving cars when they're not using them. So, what are you most excited for Tesla to achieve from their list of groundbreaking technologies set to get released next year? Do you really think all this is going to happen at once? We'd be happy if you let us know your comments about this and hope you'll experience the utmost relaxation after watching this episode. If you do, hit the like button and join Tesla Car World by subscribing to our channel. Your feedback and time are very much appreciated. Thanks for watching and we look forward to seeing you soon. Until then, take care and God bless.